In 1850s London, a doctor became so desperate to prove the truth that he drank water contaminated with cholera, just to make a point. This is the story of Dr. John Snow, the man now known as the father of modern epidemiology. In the early 1850s, cholera was tearing through London, most scientists believed in the miasma theory that diseases spread through bad air. But John Snow disagreed. He believed cholera spread through contaminated water, especially from public pumps. In 1854, during the deadly Broad Street cholera outbreak, Snow began mapping every case. He discovered that most victims lived near the Broad Street water pump. Almost all of them drink from it daily. To prove his theory, Snow used two bold strategies. First, he convinced local authorities to remove the pump handle, and almost immediately the outbreak collapsed. Second, according to Snow's own reported demonstrations, he drank water from a cholera-infected well to show that clear-looking water could still be deadly contaminated. He didn't get sick, but the act shocked the medical community. Snow's detailed data, interviews, and maps forced people to confront the truth. Cholera came from water, not air. Snow's work didn't just end an outbreak. It rewrote medical history. His investigation became the foundation of modern public health. And all of it started with one doctor willing to risk his life for a theory the world refused to believe. 